Hey guys, Aussie Hype here with a review on Mizuma Mobile today. .com .au. Um, I'm sending away my old N95 8GB. If you don't know what Mizuma Mobile is, what Mizuma does is you go on their website, you type, you find your old mobile phones that you don't use anymore, working or non working. You put it into the computer and I'll give you a price for it. Like my broken N Nokia N95 2 8 gigabyte because it's the second edition, non working. I mean thirty two dollars and twenty cents. Focuses, yep. Um, which isn't too bad for a phone that's been sitting in my drawers for at least a year now, doing nothing. So I get thirty two bucks twenty for it. Um, so basically, after I apply for it. About 48 hours after I did, I received this envelope. In the envelope, it came with a delivery note, free post bag, and posting instructions. This is just like an introduction, saying thank you for turning your own mobile into cash and Mizuma Mobile. We look forward to giving it a new lease of life. We hope you find our online process simple, fast, and friendly. Uh, basically how it works, how Mizuma works, keeping up to date with stuff, just saying thank you for um, doing it. Another thing you get is the receipt. This is the receipt that when you send it away, you have to send this delivery note receipt to them because it has the barcode on them, ID, and the mobile phone in the free post bag. Basically, that's just telling me that I get a check. Um, as soon as this is done, I get a check in the mail about 48 hours later. So, yeah, this is the bag that you get. Just going to cover up because I've already written my details down. But as you can see, it just sends it to. It's actually in Victoria. This is based in Australia. If it says here, no stamp required if posted in Australia. It's free post bag. Very big bag. I'll be sending it away later today before I go to work. Another thing you get is the packing, the postage, posting and packaging instructions by Mizuma themselves. Just open it up. Postage instructions, options of how you can send it. You can just chuck it in the mailbox, which is completely free. The do and don'ts about it. Second option is you can take it into your local post office, which is recommended. This is the easiest method. This is recommended. It's going to cost you for insurance. So if they do lose it, you, um, I think they just tra they can trace it and stuff. With this, you can't trace it. This you can. The do's and don'ts about it. On the back, evidence of identity. It just tells you what how to send your ID away. More information number and just the Mizuma characters on it. So that's basically what you get in the envelope that they send you. It's a pretty thick envelope um, when I received it. So I'll make a follow up video to this to show you that Mizuma Mobile is legit or not. My odds are that 95% chance. Or 99% chance they are legit because so far everything that they've told me is 100% true. I heard about it on the TV, and usually a lot of things that go on the TV have to be legit, like quid quid bids. I'm thinking of doing a review on that. I'll post a link of uh, Mizuma Mobile in the description if you want to check it out for yourself. Hopefully, I can make a follow-up video of when I received the check for the $32.20. Uh, within 48 hours and I'll post the next video up for you so till next time guys hype on